This is uh, another demo of the uh, software-defined radio using the uh, TC 3.1. Uh, this version of it is a little bit different. It implements uh, s uh, image suppression or sideband suppression. So I'm listening to uh, 20 meters this evening, uh, upper sideband. So quickly, again, I got the soft rock. I'm actually tuning it with this um, HD SDR, but I'm just using it basically to, to tune the uh, the master uh, VFO. Um, that's going in here through the uh, little isolation transformers to block the uh, ground loops. I had to put a little amplifier in here, so I got a couple of op amps, which allows me to adjust the IQ balance and uh, gives me a little bit <coughs> larger signal going into the Teensy. So that's going into the Teensy audio shield. Um, the audio output is going into this little speaker here, which is what you're hearing. Uh, the spectrum display here, um, the, the range is uh, 22 kilohertz. The red line is, uh, is actually 11 kilohertz um, internally. So the what's coming out of the soft rock is a basically uh, being sampled at 44 kilohertz so it has 22 kilohertz bandwidth um, I have a local uh, VFO in the software that's taking uh, the is, is a 11 kilohertz VFO it's basically pushing this 11 kilohertz uh, section down to DC so I'm avoiding all this garbage here this, this is all hum and noise and stuff coming through and uh, I'm very neatly cutting that out by actually shifting the audio down and processing it. So I'm, I'm not actually processing the audio that's in this very noisy section here. So you push it down. Uh, it's going through a, a matched pair of Hilbert filters, which is separating uh, the I and Q, or basically doing an, an additional shift of 90 degrees. <clears throat> and then you add those two outputs, which in this case is giving me uh, upper sideband. So the sideband suppression isn't great, uh, still got to work on that, but um, so if you watch this, you hear the audio coming through. So if I swap I and Q, So we swap it back. Signals back again. <laughs> 